Uh, uh, this is Dutch. Great. I forgot to put it back to English. Um. Yeah. And uh, and uh, we're back. <laughs> hey, hey guys. Uh, my name is Robo, and uh, welcome back to a new video. By the way, do you like my prop new profile picture? Um, I made it myself because I was bored. Uh, but uh, welcome by uh, to another game. Uh, no, not really a game. It's more like a simulation and more than a game. But um, today we're playing Space Engine. Oh my god, it's bugging out. So this is a beta version. This is exactly beta 0.9.4. Um, which is not even out yet, but it's open for beta. It's open beta, of course. But if you don't know what Space Engine is, it's basically a ginormous, a ginormous exploration world that's really fucking stunning. If you like space, you fucking should ch check this out, alright? Because this is just so incredible that, like, the. the the team. There's not even a team. That's that's the war part. There's not even a team working on this. It's just one person. One person. Serious? Like, look, look at this, guys. This looks so amazing. But uh, what we're gonna do today? We're gonna find some planets with fucking life. So, um, by doing that, by the way, yeah, you just go over here and just filter stuff out. But um. I don't know if we're gonna do that or not. Uh, probably gonna do, but the amount of detail that has put into it, like you can't just go everywhere. Just press press on a star or click on a star, double tap G, and you're there. It's as simple as that. And you can just choose whatever planet you want to choose. Double G on that. And by the way, if you want to choose which planet you do, it's F2. So you open up this menu here. Um, but look, look how beautiful this looks, man. Um, this looks really stunning. And overall, the effects, like the shaders on this, on this thing, or I mean, program, software, simulation. I don't know how you want to call it. Are just amazing. Okay, like they, he, he. All right. He put in a lot of fucking detail in this shit. Into this shit. And, uh, also, this is all producial generated, so, um, you can see the detail. That's strange. Uh, <laughs> not too much detail, I guess. But, um, we can, for instance, go to Earth. Like, every single planet we know now is in this game, and what's beyond, or what we don't know. Is randomly generated so basically if we go to earth that's of course a thing we know which is all the way over here um, you'll see that if it loads up really quick um, you can see it really looks nice just look at that just a motion blur too if you can see on the stars but uh, you can see Australia here Asia that's where I am now, right here. Now let's go to the exact day, uh, time right now, which is uh, 2016, uh, the 27th of July or June. What is it? Um, I don't care, but it's 1810, which uh, is uh, sent or West Europe or Western Euro time, Europe time, which is correct. Uh, so this is where I live right here and this is also correct because it's almost dark <laughs> so great um, you can see it looks oh, so gorgeous that it fucking I guess him man or, or I guess him or you want to pr pronounce it um, look at that it's kinda <laughs> really detailed <laughs> too much detail yeah it's kinda spazzing out that's of course of the water um, and this game is still in beta so uh, that's also an excuse um, 
but what we can do here, you can also go, for instance, to like Saturn, for instance, like uh, go to the rings, give a fly through the rings if you want to, like look, you can just approach the rings and see all these little ice and rocks and stuff, and uh, this is my favorite part about this. You can, if you go behind the sun, you get this nice glare. This is actually a theory how the astronomers discovered the last ring like the outer rings like if you look at from the front you don't really see the outer rings but once you uh, go behind uh, Saturn where the Sun is at you can see all these rings um, that they can see from a fr uh, from front view you know so that's how they discovered it and this looks really amazing I think that's the Orion Nebula, I'm not sure. Is it the Orion Nebula? I think it is. This is the Orion Nebula. Uh, I see, what, I see... Ah, never mind. This is not the Orion Nebula. What's this? Flame Nebula. Oh, here's the Orion Nebula. Alright. Uh, so this is the Orion Nebula, you can just, like, explore. Like what's inside is all pink and stuff and uh, we have scorched deserts and st you can just uh, get lost like you can all the see all these lava pools and stuff so you can get really lost easily and it's just amazing it's just amazing how technology nowadays can actually make this so uh, yeah I'm pretty pretty impressed uh, but yeah, if you want to check this game out, uh, you can just like go in the comments or no, not the comments in the description. Um, you can check you can check the link down there. Um, and you can download the version, I think. Or would I just give you the site? I will just give you the site. You can explore the site yourself and uh, hopefully find the download in there. Um, but nonetheless, this is an amazing game or a simulation that you should actually really check out and support. Um, I've supported, I've donated, uh, because this is like... This is stunning. This is really stunning. Um, but yeah, if you can see, you can also just go out of the galaxy and explore all these other galaxies that are mostly just random generated, like for instance this one. This one is just also randomly generated with randomly generated stars inside if you can see you can just click on every si star and just go to them and just search how many planets and if there's life and stuff so it's really nice it's it's really if you if you like space you should actually just check it out um, it's in the description down below so you can just check out the link of the site and you can download it from there hopefully uh, it should not be really uh, difficult I guess but um, yeah thank you for watching hope you like this video if it give it a thumbs up and stuff if you like it um, give it a thumbs down if you don't like it because um, you need to be honest I guess <laughs> um, and then um, share this with anyone, uh, I don't know, and uh, subscribe if you want this stuff uh, on your feed and if you want to see more. Uh, but yeah, I see you guys in the next one, so uh, yeah, see ya.